but these do come out. We'll focus on this one first. And this was ten pounds. These do come out, so say you wanted a two arms, well, a bar style spinner. You could just take those out. It still spins very, very well. Or if you wanted one of those, I don't know what they call them, cylindrical spinners, where there's no arms, no nothing on them, just the bearing and a casing around it. I'll tighten the caps down a bit. Oh, the caps actually appear to be tight. It spins really, really well. What enjoyment you'd get out of that, I don't really know. So, let's put these back in. Oh, for whilst we've got it open. Oh, no, actually, we'll put a couple back in first. Just to hold it in place. Caps do remove very, very easily, and they're screwing, which and the metal, which I think just adds to the quality, and it makes it really, really nice. It spins very well. A little bit of rattle, maybe that's coming from the casing or the bearings. I don't know. It is an Ibex Seven bearing. I believe it's. Uh, 608 in size correct me if I'm wrong but there you go put the caps back on I oh, was saying that the caps only go one way which I believe is that way because as you can see it's got oh focus focus there we go as you can see it has a step two two steps so that has to fit into there, so the caps sit evenly, and that one has a miniature step, and they thread into each other. Buttery smooth threads, and as you can see, they're sitting evenly apart. Zoom this in a bit. trying to do this was looking through the camera oh and as you can see these are threaded sorry about the camera quality and I have multi coloured o-rings on I, from what I saw in this shop because as I, as I did with purchase the, yesterday those two spinners it was the mobile phone shop. They did have a similar style to this, like the cylinder, well the circle, with the arms coming off. Just they were, it was blue, and I've seen them in all sorts of colours, but there was no O-rings or bands, whatever you want to call them, on the arms themselves. Spins beautifully. And I was happy about the packaging because it's a pretty hard case. Sits in there nicely. And here's the black one, torque bar style. It's not nowhere near as weighty as this one. This has a lot of heft to it. But I believe that's because it's brass. Yes, very... It's noisy, but... I like, I like the spin and the fidgetability of it because you can just flick it with your I don't know what that is your, um, middle finger, index finger, I don't know no, your index finger is that there now or your middle finger let's just say get a really nice spin on it I did unbox it, I did unpackage it earlier and I may have dropped it because the paint works slightly scratched up but for the price point, £6.99, really can't grumble. And metal caps again, with the stepping, but it's very, very minor. 
and I don't have a clue in hell what bearing this is because it's that small. I think it's something like a one oh is it one oh six? I'm not sure maybe. Um do I have anything to push the bearing out with? Shite, I should have brought my screwdriver up. Um hold on with me folks. Oh, well, I'll just have to try and push it out with the cap. There we go. Very small bearing. I believe there's something like seven in there. Coincidentally, there is seven in there. One, two, three, four, five, six. Hold on. Two, four, six. Oh. Correct me, correct myself, does eight. So it's an ABEC 8 bearing. Very small bearing. Press fit. And I should have showed with that, the other one, but that bearing doesn't... When I unboxed it and took it apart earlier just to get to know it, it didn't appear that it came apart. Well, the bearing popped out, should I say. Oh, I believe I've put the caps on the wrong way. Yes, that is the way. Sorry if I'm out of camera, folks. Let's zoom it out a bit. Focus back in. And as you can see, I've scratched it up a bit, but it's got a very nice feel to it. I believe this is aluminium or aluminium, depending where you come from or how you say it. On a finger spin, it is very wobbly, but that I just believe that's from the size of the bearing and the weight of the spinner itself, or that I'm very shaky, which I'm known to be. And, um, well, yeah, and tin, tin's quite nice, quite solid. Wouldn't have expected that for 6 .99. Oh, look, there's a sim in it. <laughs> what is it? It's a three sim. <laughs> Put the phone on later, see whose number it is. So, yeah, there's that spinner again. Talk bar style. When you when you're holding it with two thing, well, a finger and a thumb, it does feel very nice in the hand. I will admit. So, put that in there. Close the lid. Back to the style of the shot. Smooth, smooth, smooth. Makes a nice pattern. When it's spinning. I don't know if you can hear that. But there is a very, very minor rattle. I don't know what it's from. But. Uh, and I really like the weight of this one. For £10. Because I did have a look just. Previously on eBay. I believe it was eBay or Amazon. I'll try and get it up again. Um, hold on folks. Items you've recently viewed, Amazon, sorry, and it is if I actually did view it. I don't know, I'll just find it. I uh, see. There is, I'll turn my brightness down a bit. There is this one here, 
which is 12 pounds it's similar to this but that's what I was talking about where you can get them without the bands on oh, let's have a look see if there is any others there you go did I click on the right one yes 18 pounds and that is not with no that is delivering can I get that on Prime yes I believe I can whether there is any more see there twelve ninety nine. that's with Prime so there's discount £10.37 which is much more close to well very close to what I paid but that's most likely from China £19.99 it's saying here pure copper though I don't didn't believe this was copper but I'll do an update video at some point maybe in the next couple of weeks because then we'll know if it's copper or brass because of the style of patina. Because I'm pretty sure this is going to be my main spinner, what I'm using. Because I, I just love how it feels. This and the red one, they're probably my happiest purchases I've made in the past few months of anything. Because of the quality, especially that plastic one. £3, it, I've seen them for 5 and they don't feel as high quality. And there's another one, £23. 59 oh 188 bearing that's what that says whether it's the same as this one I don't know and if you can see this one here what I'm putting at this grey one that is a purchase I'm going to make at some point or at least the same style as that because I'm going to try and bring as much content to you as possible whilst I'm down at very 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 few subscribers I'm not going to be uploading as much but I will try and make some purchases to get as much content out daily or weekly as I can £6.99 so that's obviously from China six point hand fin finger spinner torque bar brass well it is not a torque bar because the torque bars are that style but thinner and I believe they only come in brass or copper £10.75 and yeah, just leave it. Leave in the comments links or whatever of fidget spinners that are reasonably priced because I'm going to be a low-end market to mid-range market fidget spinner and item reviewer. And I'm always going to give my honest opinion. Whether I buy them or whether they get sent to me by a viewer or a, what would you call them, a vendor or a manufacturer will not change my opinion. I'm going to be completely unbiased. If I'm if I don't like something, I'll tell you. Even if I purchase it myself, I ain't gonna lie. Say, so, have I got an example of what I'm not really that happy with purchasing lately? Um, Say this tank here on my e cigarette. The tank, £30 for the standard kit. I was really happy with it. But then this is the second call because I got through the first one. This one is ceramic. I am not happy with this at all. Shall we see if it'll. <laughs> not happy with it at all. But the juice I'm vaping on, just a bit of a gander here. Candy vape. Vodka and Red Bull, 20ml bottle, because these were £2.50, so I purchased a couple, and yeah, let's get back to the fidget spinners, sorry about that, oh, copper skull, well, right, I'm, on, I'm already dragged it out to 15 minutes, so there's a bit of a spin for you, so yeah, anything you want to suggest that I could improve, just leave it down in the comments, and yeah, See you later. Here we go. There's the two fidget spinners. Zoom it out. There we go. See you later, folks.